Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to New York. We are going back to an easier time, back to the summer of 2019. In many ways, this is going to be my way of getting over the fact that the world is so different now. Thinking back about how things were and hopefully how things will be again soon. New York is one of those happy places for me, so it seems appropriate to travel here. And in this vlog, I'll take you to one of my favorite places on Earth, the best sculpture supply store in the world. In order to function properly in the morning, I need coffee. New York is filled to the brim with fancy coffee, hipster coffee, and I'm a sucker for fancy hipster coffee. The Highline Hotel is one of those hidden gems. It's a hotel in Chelsea in New York City with an amazing cafe on the ground floor. It's on 10th Avenue, which is close to the West Side Highway, which we drive down when we enter the city. And it's located a mere 15 minute walk from our pilgrimage's destination. Even though I've been many times in New York and walked the street of New York City quite a bit, it's always pretty surreal. This is the building King Kong climbs on, for example. Finally, we reach our pilgrim's end, the complete sculptor. Anyways, the Complete Sculptor is a sculptor's mecca. Together with the Met, it is one of those places a sculptor must visit if he travels to New York City. Imagine a giant store, like a grocery store, but with no groceries and everything you need for sculpture. It's a rare find, as most art stores are aimed at hobbyists, which they have to be, I guess, in order to survive. This place, however, is aimed at the professional, with everything that a professional sculptor might need. Armature wire, clay. Funny story actually, first time I came to New York in 2011, I carried two of these giant 25 kilo blocks of Chavant through the streets of New York way too far until I got too tired, gave up and got myself a cab. I had never seen anything like this place before and getting Chavant was not an easy task in Norway at the time. So I bought as much clay as I could possibly carry. They sell Resil Palm, which is the silicone I recommend to use if you want to use a silicone similar to the one that I use here in Florence and you live in the US. They have Aqua Resin as well, which is very similar to the Hydro Resin that I used to cast with. Probably a little bit better, honestly, if you ask me. They are wax for bronze casting. Chemicals for bronze patinas even. This brand right here, Sculpt Nouveau, actually has a really good YouTube channel with tutorials on how to create bronze patinas. So if you're interested in, in sculpture and bronze patinas, you should definitely check them out. Sculpt Nouveau. My favorite things are the odd things that are hard to find anywhere else in the world, like silicone glue. Since I'm only here once a year, I'll grab two. Or maybe three. The tool section is amazing, and even though I have all the tools I need, I grab a few every time. Camper tools and sculpture house tools are high quality tools and are very hard to come by in Europe. Actually very hard to come by outside of the US in general. Now the first one that I grabbed here, I don't think I've ever even used. The second one, however, gets a fair bit of use on larger scale sculptures. Now, the world seems to have turned itself upside down in 2020, and I didn't get to go to New York this summer. Hopefully, 
Next summer, I can take my yearly trip again, and hopefully the complete sculptor survives, so I can go there as well. Thank you for watching this vlog from when life was normal. Hopefully, we'll get back to it soon. Eric and Neve from New York City, out.